Monkey 1000 and today I'm going to work on my diamond painting. This is that mirror that I showed you guys and I'm going to take you along with me. So stay tuned. Okay guys, so as you remember, this was my little mirror compact for my purse. I thought that was so cute. Hopefully it's not glaring and bothering you guys. This has got... Um, does it have stuff on there? No, I don't think so. I thought maybe it had like that peel stuff, you know, on here, but I don't think so. Anyways, so we're going to start here. We're going to do the heart. And what you're going to do is peel this back and it's sticky. So um, you don't want to get anything on it. Just do the numbers and then put it back when you're not, not finished, you know. So we're going to start with, this is all the beads right here diamonds whatever you want to call them i'm going to start right here on seven and we're going to do that one today so i'm going to cut this up get it off of here and put that aside here's your boat they give you a pen and you also get the wax that's one thing about these kits they give you everything so if you never tried it you want to try it you don't have to go buy all this stuff you know, it comes with it. If you want to give it as a gift, great gift. Fabulous gift for somebody. So, um, what I'm going to do is cut this open. And I'm going to put it in the little boat. So, we're going to do that. And I'm just going to throw them in here. And do a little at a time here. Okay, so... I'm going to peel this off on one side. You will end up doing both sides. So I'm going to put this over here. I am blind when it comes to this stuff. So I'm going to use this today. Hopefully I'll be able to, oh yeah. I'll be able to see this really good with this. Fabulous. Fabulous. So I'm going to shake my little diamonds here. And what we're going to do, we're going to take a little bit of wax here. Um, there's paper on here and you're going to take the little wax off and you're going to dab it in there for people who have never done this before and get your wax on there. I don't know if you guys can see the wax on there and just make sure you got it on there and then cover it back up because you don't want to get dirt on it or anything. Bruno's over here. He's making noise if you hear him. And I'm just going to put the diamonds on there. Oh, very cool. I haven't done one in a while. I did finish my mother's. I'll show it to you at the end of this video again. Um, maybe we'll put some of this stuff on there. The sealer. I do have the sealer. I haven't done it yet. I had to let it flatten for a long time. And now I did. And I put it in a room when I was cleaning up the house because I was getting tired of it being on my table. And Shaber is supposed to make a frame for it, so he needs to get the frame going on that one. Shaber's under the weather, so go and see him on the, his channel and wish him um, to get better. That would be nice for him. He's in the bed, not feeling good. So, so we're going to do all the sevens here. I'm going to bring it up so you guys can see a little bit better. Um, and you should be able to see the diamonds on there. There you go. Cool, huh? And we'll just do a little bit more. I don't know if I bring you in more. If you guys could see more. I don't know. There, bring it over like that. Maybe you guys can see it a little bit better. So, the magnifying glass helps, especially if you don't have good eyes. So, my eyes are not good anymore. And it really helps because some of them are really, really tiny. This one's not too bad. This is about medium, I would say, for looking at it. Uh, could I see it without uh, the magnifying glass? I can see it, but not well. 
So if you guys have trouble, magnifying glasses, that the uh, diamond boards, those are great to use. Um, yeah, they really help. I have the board too, but I didn't think I'd need the board with this one. Um, you know, you just, I thought this would be enough. And uh, yeah, so I'm looking for all the sevens. That's what I'm doing. Try to keep them in, in the middle and cover up the white part as much as you can. Also, you want your diamond facing up on the boat, as you can see, and you pick this up like this with your wax. Oops, maybe. And push down on it. Well, I might have one on there. Do I have one? No, I don't. There. So, and then it picks it up. Oops, sorry. Let's do that again because I don't think you got it. And you just push down on it. I'm trying to do it without. And there you go. So, for people who have never done this before, for others who have done it, they know what I'm talking about then. So, Bruno is sitting here scratching. He has allergies. And his allergies are acting up. I got him groomed and he's been scratching. So I think it was something, maybe the shampoo. I should have told them and I didn't. So it's kind of my fault. Um, he is on allergy pills. So I do give him those. Um, so. There we go. Well, seven is not too many on here. There's a, there's only a few I see. It's not a big one. P seems to be the biggest one. And here's some sevens down here. There we go. Very cute. I can't wait to have it done. I was going to work on this yesterday and I wasn't feeling very good myself. So, um, it wasn't the flu or anything. I think it has to do with, um, they put me on the uh, Ozempic. So, to help sh my sugar better. Um, my sugar is hereditary, definitely, from both parents. And um, also to help me to lose some weight so I can get better. <coughs> um, I do have a bad thyroid, so that's not helping me either lose weight. And that's hereditary, so. So hopefully it works, it's been working. Um, it's a slow process though, but uh, it probably would move faster if I would behave a little bit better and maybe get outside and start walking which I want to do, but it's been so cold. And we had all that rain for like three days straight. That was horrible. So today is sunny, but it, it's cold. It's cooler. Um, yesterday was cold. Colder than right now, I think. Right now it's very nice out there. I can walk around right now. But, um, yeah, so... Hopefully, Shavier gets out of feeling better soon. I don't know what he's got. Kind of maybe a cold or something. You know, we get used to the 100 degree weather even though we gripe about it. Our bodies are used to it. So when we go down in the 30s and 40s, it's really tragic for your body. You're not used to that. So everybody's like in shock and hiding. <laughs> we hide. <laughs> yeah, so... It'll be nice to be able to get out soon and start walking. I think I'm going to do it as a weekly basis um, and get some exercise. I need to get out of this house. It's driving me crazy. So, get out and move around a little bit more. Okay, I'm just turning it around so I can see if I see any more sevens because I don't want to sprinkle the whole thing in here and then have to put it back in. Um, 
If I'm done with the sevens, then I'm done with all the sevens, you know. There's not that many of them. I don't see any more. Not at this point. Sometimes I'll mess them, and when you get closer to having them done, um, you'll see it and go, oh, I messed that one, you know. That's what I did. Oh, I see two, two sevens from here. Okay. And there's another seven here. There we go. So, there we go. I'm going to show you how it looks. It's getting there. I see another seven. I'm going to get all the sevens done and then we'll move on to the next color. And there you go. Hopefully, you guys can see that. Hopefully. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. There you go. I think you can. All right. So I'm going to shut you guys off so you don't get too bored of me. And we'll we'll do the, make sure I got all the sevens done. And when I go to the next one, I'll bring you back. Okay, guys, so the next one's going to be letter F that I'm going to do. And the number is 111, three ones. I'm going to open this up. Um, what I did with the other one, I put them in my little containers, and what I do is I cut the label and I just shove the label in there. Instead of having to make labels, I don't have a label machine, so instead of buying one, I didn't want to put too much money into all this. I just wanted to be able to do it if I like it, you know, if I don't do it, then I didn't have a lot of money into it, you know what I mean? Um, so I'm going to pour some out here in my little bucket, or boat. You call it a boat, I guess. Shake it up a little bit. Hopefully you guys can see I'm shaking it up. And the diamonds are turning up. So, this one is F. So, we're going to look for all the Fs in here. And there's quite a few Fs. So, you can do it any way you want. This is like a, I would say like a red, reddish pink. Very pretty. And there's F over here. It didn't really go into any um, way particular of doing it on this one. I just look for the number and, and put it in there. That's what I do. So that's all I'm doing is putting it in there. So, hopefully you guys can see. Uh, you see what I'm doing here. And I'm just finding the Fs. That's all I'm doing. And if I got two Fs together, I do them side by side. Um, some people do it in a pattern way. It's up to you on what you feel comfortable. I mean, on this, it's small. It's not real big. big. It's not like doing a picture. Um, sorry guys, I think I moved you. You know, um, so I think this will work just fine. And we'll get this one. And yeah. So I'm not going to get this done today. I'm not expecting to. I've just brought you along for a little bit, and when I finish it completely, then I'll bring you back when we get ready to put the uh, stuff on there, and I'll show you progresses maybe in between, so you guys get the idea. It's fun. It's relaxing. Um, good to job. You could do this with your kids, you know, or your, you could give it to a young girl. Um, little kids, it'd be a little bit hard to do, you know, but, um, I think they have bigger ones for little kids, <coughs> and, uh, so you could go on Timu and find those. I just thought this was cool. 
The only thing with the diamond painting, I don't have a lot of room to just put, I lost the diamond, um, to put um, on my walls, you know, pictures. Now some people put them in a portfolio. Um, so I try to find different stuff besides pictures. So, um, yeah. And like this, I'm gonna, be, I'm going to be able to use this, you know. This is going to be usable. So, that will be fun. I just lost my diamond. It fell off. Yeah. And you want to make sure your diamonds are turned up the right way. And this one turned on me. There, I got it going here. And I'll push it with my finger a little bit. Sometimes it's easier to just use your finger than it is to... There we go. Than it is the pen. So, yeah. Hope I'm not showing my head the whole time on here. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So, this is F. i got to keep reminding myself that what number I'm on. F. And we got lots of F's in the middle here. Yeah. Let's see. F here. And sometimes, if you don't get them in the circle right, they don't look good. So you want to try to get them in the circle as much as you can. And it'll make them look better. Because you want to cover that whole circle. Though If you don't, you might have a little bit of white showing. And it won't look as good. So, right now I'm doing a whole circle with F's. I'll show you after I finish this one. This part here. So... I just haven't been able to do this. My mom's still in the rehab hospital. She's still having some issues. It's getting a little bit better, I think. They're giving her um, different meds to help her with her nausea and her dizziness. So that's helping a little bit. Okay, so um, let's see if you guys can see that. There we go. And, yeah, and you can see that I did the circle right here. Yeah. So it's going to look really pretty. That's going to be really cute. Really cute, guys. So, I'm going to continue the F, and then we'll come back. Okay, guys, so I finished that one. Now we're on to the R. I don't know if you guys can see that. There's the R. And I don't know why it's so dark. Let me see if that light over there needs to be turned up some. I thought I had it all the way. Now I don't. There, maybe that'll help. So, now we're on to the R. So, the R is kind of a light. I say a light yellow maybe. Yeah. So there's your bucket there. Of diamonds. And you always want the diamond facing up. I'm gonna get a little bit more wax on here. And uh, do it that way. So I just dab it in here for people who don't know. You just dab it in there and your wax is on there. Okay, so there we go. So now I'm going to do R. It's like a yellowish um, color, I think. The R. I don't know, it glistens, so it's kind of, it kind of will glisten with that pink because you're putting it around in front of where I had that pink one. 
So I'll do a bit here and show you. This is moving quite quickly. You could probably finish this in the afternoon if you wanted to. No, I can't because I had to make supper and um, upload um, my videos. So I'm going to do that while I'm making supper. And I have to go see my mom. I go and see my mom at dinner time for her. But I don't always want to eat what they have. So I'm not going to eat there tonight. I, I just sit there with her while she eats and talk to her. So she's not by herself. There are a group of them um, that sit together and they'll all talk and I'll socialize with them or something. And then I then I take her to her room and we sit there and we watch TV for a little bit. And, and then I help her put her pajamas on and get her ready for bed. And, and then I come home. And uh, they're doing a release day on the 27th. But I don't know if she's going to be coming home yet. I might be putting her into a nursing home for a little while um, to get more rehab. I'm trying to see how she feels about it. I mean, I don't want her to feel like she has to be forced to go there. You know, because you know, if you don't want to be somewhere, you're not going to do well. And she's the one who has to be there, you know, even though I come to visit. Um, I don't want her to feel like she has to. So I'm making it on her. And she's getting a little bit stronger. She did make the nurses mad yesterday. She got up with her walker, but she's been using the wheelchair. And she got up and went to her walker and went to the bathroom by herself and didn't say anything. And then she couldn't get off the toilet by herself, so she had to call them. But, um, yeah, so. Um, but I want to make sure she's going to come home and stay home and not be back in the hospital again. You know, we can't do that back and forth stuff. It's just exhausting for both of us. And it's, it's not helping her, you know. Um, so I might have to make an appointment for the GI doctor to see her and, um, see what's going on. They may have to put a scope down her to see what's going on in there. Um, they're not saying her blood pressure sometimes is high. I think they got it better now. They, they um, upped her meds, I believe. So that kind of helped. So, anyways, there is a little bit of the R. Hopefully you guys can see that. I don't know what you guys are seeing because it looks really dark to me, but hopefully not. The circle, and there you go. Very cool. It's going to look really pretty. So, very nice. So, anyways, that is what's going on with my mom. And, um, let me see. I'm trying to see if there's any more R's. I think there's not too many R's. I'm going to check it out. And if there isn't, I'm going to move on to the next one. And we'll be right back. Okay, guys. So the next one is going to be P. P is in Peter. P, P. Letter P. Guys can see that. Okay, so I dump it out. If you hear anything in the background, it's because I got the oven going. I'm starting supper. So I gotta heat it up. So we're gonna do letter P. Ooh, this is pretty. Pretty pretty. And there are like colors that. Oh, they're pink. These are definitely a pink. Yeah. I don't know. There you go. They are definitely a pink. Ah! Oh no. Yeah. Well, if you spill them and you drop them like I do, don't worry. 
there's plenty of them. I was afraid that I was going to run out of them on my mom's picture because a bunch of them fell all over the floor. I had to pick them up and of course I lost a bunch and my hands jerk so I don't do well with these boats. Um, I don't know. So anyways, so I'm going to shake them up again. Hopefully I didn't get anything on the floor. I probably did. I don't know. So we're going to try to do letter P next. So you guys can see. Yeah. So hopefully this isn't going to turn out too dark. It's showing really dark on here. And I've got every light on in the house. So I don't know what the deal is there. So and we're going to do letter P. There's lots of P's on this one. So it's good to know that you do get a lot of diamonds. I, I'm quite happy with that. So, <laughs> yeah. I still ran out on one and I ended up just using a closer um, color. And you, you can't even tell. You wouldn't even know it. So, um, because it, uh, there was only a few of them. And uh, so it was no big deal. But I don't do well holding these boats, so I try to keep it on the table and not shake them around too much because they do fall out of my hands. So if you have bad hands, just be really careful with these. So, and we're going to do the peas. There's lots of peas all over. So, hopefully I'll have enough. I think I will. I haven't had any problems really badly. Because I was like, oh, I wonder if you can just buy the diamonds if you run out, you know. Because, I mean, accidents happen, you know, and these things are really small. It doesn't take long for them to end up on the floor. You know, so yeah. These are cute, though. I really like this. This is gonna be cute to to do. I've been wanting to get this going, but it just didn't feel good yesterday. some more of the peas and then I'll come back and show you. Okay guys, so now I'm on the letter A. I'll show you the progress on that. So you guys can see what's going on here. Hopefully you guys can see that. I don't know why. It looks very dark to me um, looking at it. But hopefully it's not that dark um, when I put it up. So pretty cool. It is moving around um, quite quickly. So you, like I said, you could probably do this in the afternoon. So we're going to do letter A. And uh, yeah, so I'm not going to do the other side with you guys. I'll just do it and then I'll show you. Oh, these are cool. These are little diamond. Like they're like different shape. Totally different shape. I'll show it to you. Hopefully I won't drop them. I just dropped a bunch again. My hand jerks really bad, so. Aren't they cute? Cute, cute, cute. So, hopefully I got enough. These are bigger than I expected them to be. <laughs> These are letter A. So, yeah, let's see. Let me put some more wax on here. Because these are big. I wonder how they're supposed to be because, oh, I see. It gives you the pattern on the, the thing. So what you're going to do is look at the A, and you're going to put the big part in. 
I'll do a couple and then I'll kind of show you. Hopefully you'll be able to see it. So uh, the fat part's going to go on the inside. Oh cool. Very nice. So let me let me get a couple of these done. So the pointy the pointy part's going to be facing on the outside. That's what it's going to do. And they go in very easily. No big deal. Cute. Very cute. See, these are quite big, so these are not going to take no time to do. Not at all. So, I'm just getting it with my finger a little bit better. Sometimes it helps to use your fingers <laughs> just to straighten them up and make them look prettier. So, and, oops, I want to point it on the outside, yeah, get used to seeing it in one way and then when you go to the other side it's like, oh, so, and the pointy is on the outside. Very cute. So I'll show you what I've done. So you can see the bigger ones. Those are the ones I was working on, the pink ones, the big ones. And you point the on the out way. That's what you're going to do. And you see the A's are in the middle. So I'm going to do the middle now. And then I'll turn you back on. Okay, guys. So I finished that part. And I put the other one away. Doesn't that look pretty? It's starting to really look really cute. So cute. So the next one is letter X. There you go. And these are big too. These are, what color are these? They're purple. And don't drop them. Because they're probably not going to be enough of these bigger ones. Um, so you don't want to drop them. <laughs> yeah. Because they give you enough for both sides. I'm not going to take you along on the other side. I'm just going to do the one side with you guys. Um, yeah. So this is going to be letter X. And I don't think there's that many of them. So you just want to follow the um, shape that it has on the X. That's what you're going to do. Maybe we should do it in all the same exact way. Let me see. Because it's kind of oval. And I'll show you in just a minute. I hope I'm doing this right. First one I think I did fine. And there's another X. I'm just turning it around here. Oh no, I dropped it. So. Oh, I'm good at dropping these. This is really hard for me to do this with my hands. They have carpet tunnel on them. And uh, it's been really hard. But I like doing it. It's not like I don't. It's fun. And it's just, if you got shaky hands, this is not going to be good for you. Um, just keep things on the table as much as you can if you want to do it. I mean, like I said, you know, anybody could really do this. You just got to be careful. If your hands are not the greatest, it probably won't work for you. I don't know. You can try it. Use the bigger letters instead of small ones. Like in some of those pictures are very, very small. On this little thing, most of them are pretty pretty big. I mean, I'm still using the magnifying glass, but I'm using it for the light more than anything. I can see most of them. So, yeah. So, the X only went on the outside. So, 
Um, yeah, because I'm already done done the X. That's it for the X. That's pretty cool. Yeah, there's not a bunch there for the X. So uh, the X's were all these ones, these light purple ones here, and they all went around as you can see. So pretty cool. Okay, guys, so I'm gonna put this one away, and we'll get to letter M. Okay, guys, for the letter M, that's what it looks like, if you're interested in this. And the letter M is only one, and it's right in the middle. See that M? So, I'm not going to <laughs> take them all out and put them in the boat if I don't need to. So, I'm just going to take one out, and... That's it. We are going to do this one. This is a big round diamond. It's pink. And we're just going to stick it right in the middle. And be done with it. And there we go. Well, maybe. I'm going to use my fingers and move them around a bit. There we go. Press it down. And I want to move it around. So there's only one M. That's it. Wow. No more M's. Isn't that something? So, and there we go with the letter M. That was easy. Like I said, you could finish this in an afternoon. Easy. So, I'm just going to pour these in here. And there's only a few, and you will have leftovers because they give you one, two, three, four, five. There's six of them all together. So you're only using one. So And you'll use one on the other side. So they give you extra if you lose it. So that's good. Very nice. They're really good about that. So I think these are well worth the money on Timu. Now I don't know if you can find them cheaper on other things. There is a... Uh, diamond painting places that you can actually just go and that's all they have is diamond painting stuff equipment and all that but I think I'm just going to stick with Timu and use their Timu stuff I think their other stuff is probably higher I haven't checked it out so I don't know if that's true or not okay guys so the next one and the last one is letter O and there is a few of O's on here, as you can tell. The rest of it's all O's. So I'm going to try on you off, and I'm going to do the O's on my own, and then I'll show you the ending of it. Okay, guys, so I got it all done. I wonder, do you guys see what I see through the magnifying glass? There. Isn't that pretty? Wow, look at that. Cool, huh? So it's all done. Very nice. Okay, so there you go. Very cute. Okay, guys, so that's the end of that side. Cute. Really cute. Um, yeah, it's really pretty and it really glistens. So if you like bling, You'll love to do this. Yeah. I'm not a bling person like my mother. My mother loves bling. She probably liked this a lot. But I like it because I like the having a mirror in my purse that I can use to check on my makeup or whatever. When we go camping or something, I'll have me a little mirror I can take with me. So... That's it. I'm not going to bore you with the other side. When I completely finish it, I will come back and then we'll put this the sealer on top of that too. And we'll also do my mother's because I haven't done the sealing on it. So stay tuned. Let me finish this one. I don't think I'll finish it today, but in the near future, I will. And um, we'll do the whole sealing process together. So um, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed my video and stay tuned. There's going to be more. I do have another Timu coming. 
Um, it is bigger, not huge, but it is bigger than the one that I did just a few minutes ago. So uh, stay tuned for that one. So yeah, I got lots in my basket, but I have to watch my money. <laughs> These are not sponsored, so I have to be careful, but it's fun. And I enjoy buying stuff on Timu. I like some, to find different things. And I like to watch some of the girls that are buying different things. So I get some ideas. I like to have things that I'm going to use. Use in my home or, you know, out camping or for clothes that I use that I need for me or my mom or... Shea Bear, stuff that he might want for camping. I like to, to find different things. So um, that's what I'm trying to do in organization. I got a bunch of organization stuff that I want to get. I just haven't got it yet. So anyways, stay tuned for those. And Monkey Sushi's out for now. Have a great day. Bye, y'all.